Backhand. Novak. Serve. John Isner. Return. Novak as well. And celebration. <laughs> well, I think uh, I'll go for for Daniel. You were to build a perfect player, which aspects you will steal from a player? Forehand. Rafa. Sometimes it's not that uh, obvious because all his game is, is so great. I think in the last years his forehand uh, is, was the best, how tough it was to play, and especially on clay, so forehand I choose Rafa. And a dull forehand leaping off the clay on that occasion. Backhand? Novak. You shoot at him in this shot, he will always have an answer, so I'll go for him. Oh, come on, this is getting silly. I mean, you can't hit that backhand much better. Serve. I will go for John Isner, uh, because from all, the, from all the players I played against, I, for me, his serve was, was the most tough to return. Return. Return, I'll go for Novak as well. Sometimes you hit like an amazing serve to him, which is against many players, ace or service winner. And um, he not only puts it back, but he will even bring you in a, in a complicated situation. How about Slice? Slice, I'll go for Roch. His Slice was just something different. Even I remember when, when I practiced the first time with him, was was on grass and uh, the first slice he he gave to me was like uh, horrible how much uh, spin it, it had on it and uh, also he was um, choosing it so smart in the rallies so smart in the in the game net game net game I also with uh, Roger first of all he was using it the most I think he was playing to the net a lot and uh, also I really like the way he's volleying. The placement of the volleys was, was really good I thought and so I'll go with him. Are you kidding? From close range, what a volley initially from Federer. Touch? It's not easy but if I have to choose one I'll, I'll choose Roger as well. Oh look at the hands, the magistry. Speed. Speed. I go with Gael. He's 37, I think now already. He's still so fast. It was a pure joy to, to watch him sprinting for drop shots and sprinting for tough balls. Flexibility. Flexibility. I'll I'll go for Novak and Grigor. Uh, in both of them, I think they are the the same level of flexibility. Both of them can do the the full split and uh, it's also great to, to see them if, if they do it. Mental toughness? Novak and, and Rafa, they are on a very similar level. I think they, they both, not only in my opinion, but also if you look at the statistics, they will always be on, on top there, I guess. What about competitiveness? To me, it, it goes hand in hand with, with mental uh, strength, competitiveness, so I'll, I'll go with the same. Is the champion in Turin. Absolutely sensational from the dark. <laughs> celebration. Celebration. Well, I think uh, I'll go for for Daniel. The celebration was iconic when, when he won the US Open. And also I remember when, when we played the finals of, of Nito ATP finals, he, he won back then the biggest title of his career and just walked to the net and said good match and that's it and it's pretty cool. Medvedev, he picks yep. your back. Ah, great. Ah, oh, nice. <laughs>